right guys in this video we are going to discuss about windings first of all windings introduction let's see i drawn like this like this so can you tell me what are the differences between these two what it is called and what it is called and how many conductors are there how many tons are there how many conductors are there how many tons are there generally this is called single turn coil and this is called double turn coil this is a coil which having single turn this is a coil which having two turns generally one turn nothing but two coil sides one coil nothing but two coil sides every coil having two coil sides and and generally generally in single turn coil we have only one turn in that we can have a two conductors one turn nothing but two conductors here we have a two turns that's why completely four conductors every turn or each turn have two conductors sir can you tell me each turn have two conductors so which of the following is the correct answer which of the following is the correct answer option a or option b one turn having two conductors right so which is correct for example if you people say option a is the correct answer let's check it for example i have a four conductors if you substitute four in here Two times of the four eight, so it should be a eight turns. Is it correct? No, this is wrong. For example, coming to option B. For example, if you substitute T is equals to two, two to the four, so this is the correct answer. So don't try to like a mathematics is different from general English. So one turn having two conductors, nothing but Z is equals to two T. then after generally these are the one coil this is one coil this is the coil side one this is the coil side two this is the coil side one and this is the coil side two the distance between two coil sides of a coil is called is called coil span gamma in some textbooks it denotes with beta in some textbooks it denotes with gamma so coil span gamma nothing but the distance between two coil sides of a coil what is that that is called coil span generally for full pitch winding what is that for full pitch winding the coil span gamma is exactly equals to 180 degrees generally for short pitch winding the coil span gamma is less than 180 degrees for over pitch winding the coil span gamma greater than 180 degrees this is simply what about the coil span the distance between two coil sides of a coil and uh, another one what is the pole pitch can you tell me yes pole pitch nothing but for example this is the one pole here and this is the one pole and this is the one pole like a four pole machine i have here the distance between two adjacent poles is called pole pitch simply pole pitch nothing but the distance between two adjacent poles is called pole pitch this is also for full pitch winding pole pitch is equals to 180 degrees for short pitch winding pole pitch less than 180 degrees 
for war pitch winding the pole pitch greater than 180 degrees as usually this is simply the first definition of coil span and the next one is the pole pitch and generally for four pole machine you know very well this is a four pole machine in this four pole machine we can have a how many axes this is one axis which is called d axis this is also d axis and and uh, this is what q axis and this is what q axis what is theta mechanical actually the completely theta mechanical is equals to 360 degrees but can you tell me what is theta electrical theta electrical is equals to let's see here theta electrical is equals to let's see here see here this is 180 degrees and uh, this is 180 degrees and uh, this is 180 degrees and uh, this is 180 degrees otherwise we can have that p by 2 times of mechanical yes can you tell me how many number of poles are there here four number of poles four by two times of what is mechanical angle 360 degrees two ones are two twos are so 360 twos are 720 degrees 720 degrees is the electrical angle completely and and see here carefully theta electrical is equals to can i write like this p times of 180 degrees is it is it okay guys because this is a four pole machine right four times of 180 720 degrees so so from this from this for yes number of slots s for yes number of slots theta electrical is equals to P times of 180 degrees but I want the angle the electrical angle for one slot for one slot theta electrical is equals to what is the answer P times of 180 degrees upon yes because yes number of slots so this one slat angle is called slot angle simply it is called slat angle i am denoting with beta so the slat angle beta is equals to 180 degrees by slots per pole this is what the slat angle beta so so here one is the coil span and next one is the pole pitch and next one is the slat angle and the relation between number of conductors and the turns here we discussed generally here one conductor if it produces two volts then what is the voltage of the total turn one conductor two volts and this conductor two volts combinedly four volts as usually the same in terms of voltage also same guys so this is the introduction of windings then after we need to go for different types of windings what are the different types of winding we have a full pitch winding and short pitch winding what are the differences between these two and what is the what is the pitch factor and next one we have a concentrated winding and distributed winding what are the differences between these two and what is the distribution factor and what is the uniformly distributed winding and its distribution factor and what are the integral slot winding and fractional slot winding and the differences between these two and the distribution factor and uh, what is the balanced winding and unbalanced winding and what is the single layer winding and double layer winding like uh, these uh, many of windings are there generally the windings are two types what are those open type of winding and closed type of winding of course the open type of windings are again again 
ಲೈಕ್ ಎ ಡೆಲ್ಟಾ ಕನೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ ಕನೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಶಾರ್ಟ್ ಪಿಚ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಡಿಸ್ಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಯೂನಿಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಿ ಡಿಸ್ಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಎ ಮೆನಿ ಕ್ಲಾಸಿಫಿಕೇಷನ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇರ್ ಬಟ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಡ್ರಮ್ ಟೈಪು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅದರ್ ಒನ್ ಲೈಕ್ ಎ ಡ್ರಿಲ್ ಟೈಪು ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಲ್ಯಾಪ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ವೇವ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಿ ಸಿ ಮೆಷಿನ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಎ ಸಿ ಮೆಷಿನ್ಸ್ ಎ ಸಿ ಮೆಷಿನ್ಸ್ ಕಾನ್ಸೆಪ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಸೊ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಗೋ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಫುಲ್ ಪಿಚ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಶಾರ್ಟ್ ಪಿಚ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಕಾನ್ಸಂಟ್ರೇಟೆಡ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಡಿಸ್ಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಯೂನಿಫಾರ್ಮ್ಲಿ ಡಿಸ್ಟ್ರಿಬ್ಯೂಟೆಡ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಇಂಟಿಗ್ರಲ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಫ್ರಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಸ್ಲಾಟ್ ವೈಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ಕೋರ್ಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ವೆರಿ ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಸೊ ವಿ ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಡಿಸ್ಕಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೂ ದಿಸ್ ಫೋರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ವೀ